Hi everybody, welcome back to today's, or no, cut. Action. Wait, 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 no. <laughs> Homemade tortilla chips and more, take two, and action. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today, as you can see, we are going to be making homemade tortilla chips and more. I'm going to show you a couple of other things that we'll be having with our homemade tortilla chips. And to make this video even better, I have a special guest with me that y'all haven't seen in a while. I'm back. He has been so busy lately with uh, work and with studying for his certifications. And it is a Sunday, which is why I'm looking like a bum. Sunday bum day? Is that a thing? I, I don't know, but it should be. It should be. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm totally bumming it out. Let's and... uh, back up and get, oh. get a real good look at what's going on here. Yes, honey. Yes. Work it. Vogue. Vogue. Yup. Okay. So this is Sunday's outfit. And uh, one thing that I really would like to capture is my wonderful socks. Look yes. at those. I'm pretty sure you were wearing those in the last video that you were in on my channel. <laughs> Probably. So, yeah, it's okay. They're basically my go-to. So, I am just going to go ahead and jump right into this. For this recipe, you're going to need corn tortillas. The kind that we're using... Oh, Guerrero. Guerrero. This is the kind that we use. So as long as they're corn tortillas, you know, you're fine. You can even do yellow corn tortillas. These are white ones. Uh, you, the recipe is pretty big. Usually it's like 15 to 16 tortillas, but I'm cutting it in half since it's just Alex and I. So I have eight tortillas here. I've got olive oil, lime juice, and salt. And then my oven is preheating at 375 right now. So now I'm just going to combine... Are you, are you regretting having me be in this no, video I now? I love, I love having you in this video. Am I a, a bit of a distraction? Okay, so I'm going to combine one tablespoon of olive oil in a little bowl. I should have made a cooking show. You should. Free network. Mm -hmm. You're basically the next Rachel Ray, so. Yeah. You don't want to be next, Rachel Ray? No. And now I'm going to combine the olive oil with two tablespoons of lime juice. And the lime juice is optional. It just adds a nice tangy flavor. Give that a good stir. Try to mix up the best that I can. I don't think you realize the absolute temptation I had to overcome by not putting your little shaky booty in the picture. And I think... If she ends up putting that part in the video... She has a really nice shaky booty, so it's really cute. Whenever she stirs things, her booty like shakes back and forth, and it's just the most adorable thing I've ever seen. I have a little basting brush, and I'm just going to take each of my tortillas and put this olive oil lime juice mixture on one side of each tortilla. So the reason, I know I just put, oh, the oven's ready. Oven's done. Three. Wait, do your thing. My oven is done. <laughs> That's going to become a new thing that, yeah. What, what, what is that referencing, honey? That's referencing uh, one of her last videos uh, whenever she was making the cookies and doing, uh, what were you talking about again? It was uh, about like loving yourself, right? Yeah. It was that, it was that one. I'll uh, link the video down below. Yep. We'll link it. But uh, whenever she, whenever she heard the beat for her cookies being done, this is what she did. She was like, oh, my cookies are done with like two little peace signs up here by her face. And it was just, again, she's just the cutest person that's ever walked on this earth. So just putting that out there. I am doing another cooking video. I know I just posted one, but that was a lot of fun for me. I really love to cook and just kind of share recipe ideas with you guys. Um, and that video, it didn't get a whole bunch of views, but it did get a lot of really positive feedback. So I'm posting another one. And today's dinner is so fun and I wanted to share it with you guys. We like to share as much as possible with you guys. Yeah. It's a lot of fun making these videos and just kind of putting ourselves out there and sharing our lives with everybody. It's why the heck not, right? Mm-hmm. All right, so all of my tortillas are basted. And now I'm going to take a knife and cut these into six or eight pieces. They're so easy and so quick and cheap. 
if you are someone like me who always has corn tortillas laying around rather than just buying a bag of tortilla chips. So it looks like Haley's gonna be going with the eight pieces. Yeah. All right. And those are just some cute little tortilla chips. Well, soon to be tortilla chips. And of course, there is dog hair on the silicone baking sheet. On everything. On everything. Oh, speaking of dogs, here's one that has just been driving us nutso today by being needy and wanting to play all day, even when we're doing stuff. And there's our good girl, Dina. Leia's a good girl too. She can be. She is. We have very good dogs. Yeah, we're very, we're very oh. fortunate. She's our, she's our calm one though. She's very low maintenance. For the most part. Yeah, <laughs> for the most part. Until we try to take her for a walk and then she freaks out. So as you can see, Haley is uh, placing these very beautifully on this tray. That braid is really cute. Thank you. If you haven't noticed, I am absolutely, absolutely obsessed with Haley here. I just, I can't get over her, it's just, it's actually a real problem. I don't get anything done when she's around. And that's a fact. Every every time that I go up, or every time that I have to study, I have to literally leave the room. Be even if she's just sitting there being quiet and considerate and just wonderful, I have to leave the room because she will distract me. I just, I can't. Now, he's actually not even joking because I think it was last week or something, I was in here cooking and he's like, okay, <laughs> your legs giving out <laughs> anyways he was he was like okay while you cook I'm just gonna study here in the living room and so I was cooking and he came in like every five minutes and I wasn't being loud I wasn't doing anything and I'm like honey you have to go why do I keep getting stuck <laughs> wait let, let's go back and see that yep all right yep that happened <laughs> anyways I'm like why are you not studying Alex because you're too distracting. And I'm like, well, honey, I'm not even making a lot of noise. I don't understand. He's like, no, you're just distracting. Because that makes sense, so. I mean, it's true. It's true. I just, right? I just love her. I want to be with her all the times. So I have to like, if I want to get anything done ever, I have to physically separate myself. <laughs> like she can't be with an ear shot or eye shot or anything or else I just don't get anything done. It's actually gonna be a real problem whenever whenever I finally get out of the Marine Corps and have to go to college. All right, now I'm going to just sprinkle my salt all, all, what? Okay. Oil. Now, now I'm just gonna sprinkle my salt all over the tortilla chips. All over it. Okay. And I'm gonna put these in the oven for eight to 12 minutes until they are golden brown. Just getting another tray. We're not cutting. No, we're not cutting. I like looking at you. I like looking at you too much. Well, you don't have to have the camera to look. <laughs> but this is fun. Just let me have my fun. Okay. Quit ruining my time, Haley. Ow! What the did you do? The oven is so hot. I always burn myself. So one other thing oh, that she boy. always does, and I love to just. <laughs> I love to tease her. So one thing she always does, and, and I'm, I'll actually show you. Oh my so over here in our living room, we have this, we have this little uh, wax warmer or melter or oh whatever they're God, called. That? Oh yeah, yeah, I'm telling everybody. So we have this little wax melter, and the only way that you can turn it off and on is by this little by this little turny thing, you know, this little switch back here. So every time that Haley tries to turn that off or, or turn that off after it's been warmed, she always, always, always dips her hair in the wax. <laughs> always, every single time. Even though she knows she's done it before, every single time she keeps dipping it. And then she just, then she just looks at me like, it happened again. <laughs> <laughs> like it's just totally out of her control. <laughs> you are such a butt. <laughs> but she's just so darn cute. <laughs> oh my goodness. I know that I'm making fun of her, but she makes fun of me too, so it's okay. It's oh like God. it's like one of those uh, give and take relationships. I never make fun of her. Oh, that's a load of not good words that I was about <laughs> to say. Well, that's. 
the sand with you, Jim. <laughs> Wait, let me see. See that? Oh, I wow. Know. I don't, I don't know what happened there. I don't know what happened. All of the other ones were like perfectly triangle. How did that one... Why are that... you razzing on the tortilla <laughs> chips? <laughs> Is that the right word? I have no idea. So anyway, as you can see, we have a second tray full of beautifully organized tortillas, except for this one right here, which kind of looks like like a really messed up Texas. I keyed, I keyed, we have fun. I said I peed. I peed, I peed. You are something today, honey. I'm just having fun. This is the first time I've been in a video in a while, so. Why do you keep turning away from the camera? <laughs> I look like dung. Because here's the thing, people want to see that bright and shiny thing that is your face. Your smile lights up the world. That's what people come to this channel for. Not for the tortilla chips, not for the makeup, yeah, not for anything but that beautiful smile that you have. Insert. Give this video a huge thumbs up if you agree. I'm gonna give this video a thumbs up. You were literally the cutest thing in the world. That smile is just. That smile keeps me going. I get to come home to that smile every single day. I am so blessed. <laughs> I'm just gonna video you walking around and laughing. Here in the crock pot, we have teriyaki chicken, which is by far the easiest thing in the world. All that is in here are four thin cut chicken breasts and one cup of this teriyaki sauce, which is fantastic in my personal opinion. That's it, it's been cooking on low all day long for about eight hours, I would say. So I'm just gonna take it out and start shredding it. And what I love about this chicken is that you can put it on tacos. I'm going to make a little quesadilla. You can put it over rice and make a stir fry. I, you can truly just do a lot of different things with this chicken. And it's so, so yummy. I can vouch for that. Last time we had this, uh, we had, what kind of salsa was it? it was Wasn't it like a, a pineapple salsa or something? No. I was going to make a pineapple salsa. It's just a store-bought salsa. Oh, oh yeah. It was the... Uh, I forget what it was, but it was a very, very fresh salsa. Mm -hmm. So we had the teriyaki chicken, we had this very fresh salsa, and uh, some corn tortillas, and it was just, it was so good. The thing for you to give a thumbs up to this video about is if you miss seeing my face, if you want to see me in more of these videos, just give this thing a big old thumbs up, leave a comment down below, you know, wh whatever, whatever makes you happy. Uh, just let the video, or let us know that. Just let us know if you would like to see less of me or more of me, and... I don't care if anyone wants to see less of you, you're going to be in the videos no matter what. Well, I, I'm just going to say, if you do want to see less of me, I understand my feelings will just be very hurt, <laughs> and I will probably cry <laughs> myself to sleep. Um, so if you just want to crush a man's soul, uh, say that you want to see less of me. Why do you keep laughing at me? Because you're cute. I am not. You're not cute. I resent that. So once that is all shredded, I'm going to go ahead and put it back into the crock pot. Because as you can see, there is a lot of leftover sauce in the crock pot. And we want to get all of that soaking in that uh, shredded chicken. So I am about to try the chicken. It is about to blow my mind. Um, I might actually start drooling. Hi. This is so good. It's even better with salsa. Any kind of salsa. Tonight, one thing that we're actually going to show you in just a second is um, we're going to show you some black bean salsa that Mahani made. We got it. We she, You made it yesterday, right? I did. Yeah, she made it yesterday. Has been letting it sit and steep in the fridge all night, which as we know with black bean salsa. With any kind of salsa. With, really with any salsa, it's always better the longer you have it. So, we're gonna give, show you guys this and uh, give it a try whenever our tortilla chips are done. And I don't know about her, but I'm gonna put mine on my tacos. Cause I'm gonna have some uh, teriyaki chicken tacos. So here's what the salsa looks like. 
Yeah, so this is the salsa, and I would love to share this recipe. If you're interested in seeing how to make this delicious black bean salsa, give this video five, not 10, you can give me 10, at least five thumbs ups. Thumbs ups? Well, we're giving them a lot of directions on what to give thumbs up for. How are we gonna decipher whether they wanna see the video on the salsa or want to see more of me in the videos? If you wanna see more of Alex in the videos, comment down below. If you wanna see the recipe on how to make this salsa, then give this video at least five thumbs ups. And I would love to do a video on this. And I promise you guys that if you guys wanna see that recipe video, I will be there. You're welcome. All right, these are the finished product. As you can see, I already have one, but they're very crunchy. They have a lot of flavor and they are super, super easy to make. And there you have it, a very delicious meal. I have my gluten-free mission tortilla with a little bit of, I can't believe it's not butter on the bottom of it. And then there's a little bit of Mexican cheese and the teriyaki chicken in there. Got my homemade tortilla chips and the black bean salsa, and this looks so, so delicious. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you got a good laugh out of Alex's craziness, happy enthusiasticness. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see the salsa recipe, like we said, give this video five thumbs ups. That sounds so weird to me. Thumbs ups, thumb ups, thumbs ups, thumbs up. Thumb ups. Thumb. I don't know. It all kind Give of me sucks. five of these, and I would love to share this also recipe with you guys. Have an amazing rest of your day, an amazing week, and I will see you in my next video.